never knew what the one before She broke a little heart upon the floor and When I try to love, they disappear Only time can heal, but you isn't here Thank you so much for watching my Generation Beauty haul. Pretty amazing stuff, huh? For those of you who have not heard of Generation Beauty, Generation Beauty event is hosted by Ipsy, which is founded by Michelle Fan. So for you to get into the event, you have to buy a ticket. The ticket that I bought was the early bird ticket, which cost me $102.36 Canadian. And I really want to thank my good friend Ivy Manipula for letting me know about this event. I really had fun. So I went with my little sister-in-law to this event because sometimes I just feel old going to these kinds of events. So at least if I see a YouTuber that I don't know, I have I can ask my little sister because she's more updated than me. So when you get in, you get this. And it's just so they know that you're part of the event. And you can't lose this because with this, you get you also get some stubs that kind of looks like that and this is what you give to the booth for them to give you your loot bags I didn't vlog too much on this because to be honest most of our time are spent lining up lining up and lining up so instead I'll just give you tips on what to prepare or what to expect on this event the next time because this is their first time in Toronto and I would assume that they will be doing this again because there's a lot of people that attended. So my first tip is wear comfy shoes because again, there's a lot of lining up. Second, this is very important when all the YouTubers are being presented on the stage, grab the opportunity to be up front near the stage because that's your best chance to have a selfie with your favorite youtuber or have a conversation with them after being presented because they'll be on the side and you can actually talk to them and converse to them and take selfies if you end up lining up on their booth solely to take a selfie with them the lining up it takes a long time and that time can be allotted instead on lining up to get your goodies so I could say that the highlight of this event is meeting my favorite YouTubers such as Desi Perkins and Dominic. I also get to see Samantha and my little sister introduced me to Adeline Morin and I'm quite addicted now to her. So bring your charger or your portable charger. Wi-Fi is being provided by Generation Beauty so that's good. But you really need your phone because for sure you're going to be split up with your friend because it's easier for you to give your stub to your friend and she lines up for say next and then she gives me my stub and I line up for Makeup Forever that that way we're getting our loot bags way faster. So your phone is really essential plus it gets boring sometimes that so you just need to like just browse the internet check your Instagram, Snapchat, and things like that. So you would expect that the virtue for that day is patience, patience, and more patience. I am not into arguing. Well, except when I'm arguing with my husband, and he knows that, but that's another story. Anyways, there was one time that I got into a little argument at Makeup Forever, and I love Makeup Forever. I have a pro card with them. It's just that they cut the line in front of me like they just say okay we're not gonna allow you to come in anymore because that's the end of the line it's almost gonna be three o'clock and we need to close actually it's not even three yet it was like two i just didn't accept it when when they cut the line 
I went and jumped into the line where they, they are. And I was like, no, you couldn't do this to me because I have been lighting up since Saturday and you have been cutting and cutting the line. They'll have a board saying, close, will, will we open after an hour? And one hour later, you go over there and they cut the line again. So I just stood my ground and I just went there because sometimes you just have to do what you have to do. I, I paid for the ticket. If they get their loot bags, I should get my loot bag. That's just how I see it. So for Generation Beauty event coordinators, I hope there's another way than to always just cut the line for the popular boots because it's just so annoying. At the end of the day, it looked like the priority are the brands and not the people who purchased the ticket to go to the exhibit. So I hope things change. I really had fun at Generation Beauty. It's just that things could be better. And enough of the whining. The second to last tip is to confirm the time. My ticket for Sunday says 3 p.m. When in fact, Sunday, they closed at 3 p.m. Had I not asked the information people on Saturday afternoon what's the real time for the Sunday event, I wouldn't know that it actually starts early at 10 and ends at 3. Imagine if I go there at 3, I'll go out empty-handed and that's not a good thing. I lied, that's not second to the last. This is second to the last. Bring food such as granola bars, crackers, bring water or fruit because there's not a lot of options at the cafeteria and it's so hard to just go outside and go back because the event was actually at the very lowest floor at the Metro Convention Hall. Lastly, bring a collapsible bag. If you're not a creator, then no big bags for you. I was like searching on YouTube and I was like, oh my god, when I go to Generation Beauty, I'll be having this big bag and I have a lot of loots, but no, creators would get a lot of loot bags. But for a simple person, like me, um, I have to bring my collapsible bag so I can put all the loot bags there. So that's it guys. I hope you like my haul and I hope that you learned something from my tips. And I hope that I see you guys on events such as this. So if you have any beauty events that you're going to, let me know what it is. Maybe we can meet up. I would love to meet you guys. So that's it. Thank you for watching. Bye!